Hey, what's going on YouTube? Riding with Joff here. I decided to make a little series, a little how-to series. Uh, pretty much it's just going to be how to ride a bike and there will be five videos. So this is the first video. So this video is about learning your bike. So the first part, you have your handlebars. Um, if, if this is like your actual first, first time really learning how to ride a bike, I know some people start and they kind of get it and then they forget it and then have to relearn everything. Um, I do not recommend a road bike. So this is a road bike. This is what the guys use in the top races like the Tour de France and other events like that. The two reasons I do not recommend that you learn to ride a bike on a road bike, one would be the tires. The tires are pretty skinny, they're pretty thin, and they run on high PSI. So your ride will be pretty rough and because the tires are skinny, you could actually lose traction pretty quickly. Um, when you become a bit more experienced, you can actually feel when you're about to lose traction and it won't be a surprise for you. The second reason is the handlebars. So your traditional handlebars would be straight. These handlebars are actually resting your hands like this. And this is a bit of a, an aggressive position to be in, especially for someone who's just learning how to ride a bike. So those are my two reasons why you should not learn on a road bike. But if this is all you have, then that's what you got. And uh, just work with what you have. Just to go over parts of the bike. So here we have the brakes. Your left brake is the front brake. Your right brake is the rear brake. Most of your stopping power will come from the front brakes. And eventually we'll get to why you don't want to use the front brakes as much. Um, well, you don't want to use them as much while learning. So my tires are actually a, a bit old and my brake pads are a bit worn. So I don't stop as quickly. I don't have the fear of locking up the front brakes and going over the handlebars. But um, someone who's just now learning to ride a bike, you may pull the handlebars too quick or the brakes too quickly and you might fall over. You don't really want to use those front brakes too much in the beginning. So now you have the pedals. Uh, so here's your seat. You have different kind of seats for different kind of riders. So now you have your gears. So most bikes, you, your gears will be here somewhere and you'll click it uh, back and forth to go up and down gears. My bike is a road bike. So I actually push down here to go up gears and move this over. Let me do that again. Push down to go up gears and move this over to go down gears in the back and in the front. Push this to go down and move this over to go up. So that's just the intro to learning your bike, the different parts and pieces. I know I didn't go over every last thing, but I wanted to go over the main parts of the bicycle and the main parts you'll be interacting with on a daily basis while on the bike. So I hope you enjoyed this short little video about learning your bike. Tune in next time for rolling forward. That'll be the next video. How do we actually start using the bike?